Hi guys and welcome to episode 3 of season 3 of my Walsall save we got here and uh, we've come back for the Mansfield Town, is it Mansfield Town? Yeah, Mansfield Town game and uh, yeah we was meant to come back a bit earlier but they moved some of the scheduling about so we've come back for this game and we'll have the next game which is Forest Green so we've got home game double header today. Uh, just let you know if I sound a bit different it's because I've got a bit of a cold coming on. Uh, it's happened because, well, I'm blaming the fact it was a walk we went on on Saturday. Uh, you know, trying to get out of the house, be a bit, a bit healthy, and you know, trying to do a bit of exercise. Come back, come back ill. So yeah, moral of the story: exercise is not good. <laughs> so yeah, where do we go, go anyway? Uh, the last game was Shrewsbury, which we lost two one, but after that we managed to beat Carlisle four one. Uh, Wayne Rooney scoring the goal, Tawazi gets a brace, and Reese Mitchell as well. Fraser Campbell scored a consolation penalty for them. Uh, then we next played Tramir at home, uh, Sam Winnell and Ryan Leonard with the goals there. We played, these were, I think they were top, I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, we took the lead through uh, Tawazi, then Wigan managed to put, well, score two goals, Keith Moore from the penalty spot and Taggart as well. Uh, we then played Ipswich, who again hit were another team up there. Uh, they took the lead, and then uh, they actually made it 2 0. Second half came out a completely different team. Uh, Rolando Ahrens, new signing, so I, I'll show you him in a second. And Zach Clough. Uh, then after that, we had a 0 0 draw against Doncaster. Again, they're another team up there challenging. Uh, then we beat Cholton 3 2. Uh, they, uh, we took the early lead to Arzi. Then they equalised, then Herbie Kane gave us the lead with a, a fantastic strike. And Rolando Aaron scored again as well. Uh, then Ernan Ostuma from the penalty spot. It, he's actually a former Walsall player. I seem to remember him quite well. Uh, then we also played Sheffield United in the 23s in the uh, leasing.com trophy, North Group B. Uh, Reese Mitchell with a brace and Sam Winnell as well. So yeah, uh, the two new signings I'll quickly show you. Uh, I won't spend long on this. Uh, so the first one is Rolando Ahrens. Uh, he is at, was a free transfer. Got him from New. Uh, he was was at Newcastle, uh, and yeah, now he plays for us. So he's a very very quick player, uh, very agile as well. Not the best strength, and you know, not the best when it comes to everything else. But he's a free transfer. Uh, mentals are decent, or decent enough, good flair, and what you want for a left uh, winger is basically the techniques that you get so I'm very happy to have him uh, three games, two goals, one's, one assist average rating of 7.9 so yeah you can't really crumble too much of that can you? And the other new signing is a holder midfielder you know, another ball winning midfielder to uh, get some extra competition in there if Leonard isn't playing because at the moment we've got a couple of uh, deep line playmakers but he can also play as a deep line playmaker as well if we need to uh, so yeah I'm very happy to add uh, Bryn Morris to the club uh, decent physicals, quite consistent. Maybe not on the fun strength, but still quite consistent. Mentals are very, very solid, especially for the level we're at. And technicals are decent enough as well. Uh, he was playing. For, he was a Portsmouth player. Uh, he went out loan to QPR after the championship last season, but yeah, now he's signed for us. So yeah, I'm, I'm very happy to have him in. So yeah, uh, we'll go straight into the game now. Nothing else to show you, I don't think. And. Yeah, as I said, we've got Mansfield today. Oh, Gerald's been sacked as a Southampton manager. Hmm, interesting. So yeah, we'll go straight into the game. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, what we uh, the lineup we'll be playing with today is well, we're going back to the four four two formation. We've got Esquita in goal. Maguire is going to be starting at left back because uh, Colin is it Collins? Dale Collins is a uh, knackered. We've got Wallace and Hoban playing the centre halves and Matheston on the right. We've got Herbie Kane and Leonard starting in midfield. Uh, Herbie Kane, by the way, has been playing absolutely phenomenally for us. He's been superb, just running the game. Okay, he hasn't scored many goals and got many assists, but yeah, he's been absolutely did, been class for us. Uh, we've got Hardy on the right, because last few games, to be fair to him, he's, he's performed. So uh, even though we're trying to force him out, you know, for, I'll give credit credits due. He's performing well, so I'll keep him in there at the moment. Uh, Mitchell as well, starting on the left hand side, and up front we've got Wayne Rooney and Twazi. Wayne Rooney's going to be playing as a poacher, 
with Tawazi as the advanced forward. Rooney, to be fair, every time he gets the ball, he's just finding our players really well. He's you know he's doing a really good job for us. And uh, yeah, they're going in a four three three formation. So yeah, we'll go straight into the dressing room, give him a quick pep talk. Uh, <clears throat> uh, let's go out for revenge. That's always the best one I find. It's more fun anyway. Uh, faith as well. The team seems to have liked that. And yeah, straight into the game. A uh, home game. Uh, we already know it was against Mansfield as well. So hopefully we can uh, kick on and do really well. Get a good victory. We hope anyway. So yeah, as I said, uh, I've managed to pick up a cold just to confirm it's not coronavirus, no coughing or anything, just a, a very snotty nose and all that fun stuff. So apologies as well if I keep sniffing loads and I have to cough because of what backup of phlegm or anything like that. But oh, we scored already, but oh, it's offside. Wayne Rooney finds the net, but was it Rooney offside? Or was it the fullback? Oh yeah, it's the fullback. He is quite far offside. Matheson. But to be fair, it's a good ball though by uh, Kane. So yeah, it's, oh, Hardy wins it back straight away from the uh, free kick. Ball into Ozzy. Oh, just over the bar. So a good start of the three minutes. We've had a couple of chances, had a goal ruled out. Uh, positive signs, very positive. I'm watching them go and score now. Okay, so pressing on the ball. Moral, Pavad. Out wide to Malvin Benning. Inside to Tomlinson. Back to Pavan. Very, very uh, straightforward at the moment for him. And oh, they're through McManaman. Good save by Ezkita. Ezkita. So I just, it sounds quite fun to say. And it's a corner for uh, Mansfield. Ball whipped in. Headed away by Hoban, but Benning gets there first. Will he do anything with it? Can we win the tackle? Because there didn't seem to be anybody in the halfway line then. That would have been fun. Uh, but we didn't win the ball, so I have a bit of a moan because yeah, we first fifteen minutes not really done a fat lot. Day boots it down the field. I wonder if that's Chris Day. So if it is, I'm curious to see how old he is because I, I remember signing him before not really old games, and I'm pretty sure he's quite old in that as well. I think it was a total club manager I used to sign him on. Tuazi, yes, and we one nil up. Tuazi the goal, Reese Mitchell with a great assist. Ball over the top of the defender, he runs through Tuazi, doesn't just slots it in the back of the net. Let's have another look at it. Uh, Wallace plays the ball out to Mitchell with a decent ball himself, and okay, took a touch to set himself up. Great through ball by Mitchell. And tu Tuazi, great finish. Absolutely loved it. Tenth goal of the season as well for Tuazi. He is a goal machine, especially for League 2 and League 1 level. So yeah, 25 minutes in, they've got a corner. Ball whipped in Sweeney. Oh, Ryan Sweeney equalises. 27th minute. Andrea de Ga Ga Glacia, sorry, with the uh, assist. It's a good corner. Who's marking him? Oh, it doesn't even compete with him. Who was it? Hardy. Didn't compete. Oh, it's an instant uh, highlight. Wallace. Plays it back to Ezkita. Ezkita now. What will he do? Plays it to Wallace. Kane. Oh, I tried to play it through to Mitchell, but wasn't quite there. But Mitchell's now on the ball. Plays through to Hardy. Hardy. Now Rooney. Rooney. Oh, he puts it wide. You would not expect Rooney to miss that. You'd expect him to bury it. Yeah. Not what I was hoping for. Oh, Sweeney wins ahead before Rooney could get on the end of it. Hardy now. Rooney win the ball. Hardy's created a few chances. Rooney. Back to Hardy, ball across to Ozzy, blocked, and Pavan clears. We're looking to create more chances now. Can we get that goal to put us 2-1 ahead? Let's hope so. Ball whipped in, Matheson to Ozzy. Good save by Day. It's a very good save. Who is it? Bruni, ball whipped in. Headed away by Morrill. Mitchell tried to get there, but uh, Gordon beats into it. I wonder if that's our Gordon. Let's have a quick look. No, not our good and it's a Joe day. Yeah, definitely not the day I know. Many happy memories of Chris Day. I'm assuming he's retired. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you why we are in the league. 
I don't even remember where we are in the league. <laughs> I need to double check. Uh, okay, dress room. Have a quick moment at the team first of all. Not happy with the performance. Maguire's having a poor game. Uh, and I'll have a bit of a moan at these guys to up their performance. Not happy with the performance so far. So a quick look. Where are we in the league? We're 13. So we're mid table at the moment. Comfortably there. Four points off playoff places though. So we're not far off to be honest. And we're quite a few points. Nine points off a relegation battle. So we're looking up rather than looking down from mid table. But hopefully we can be a little bit more consistent. If we can be a bit more consistent, we'll be up there challenging. I really do think so. I think we've got a quality team. Mitchell with a free kick. Ball whipped in. Leonard, oh, good save by Day. Should be doing better though. Oh, he was offside anyway. Completely missed that. Hmm. Corner to uh, Mansfield. Ball whipped him, Tomlinson. Cut away, Morrell. Ball to the area, McManamum strikes it. Blocked. McManamum gets there again. Surely it's not Steve. McManamum. Oh, Mitchell wins it but loses it straight away. McManamum. Ball to the area to Morrell. Morrell now. Plays all the way back to uh, Gordon, but Hines is there. Oh, it's it's in, but it's offside. Kalen Hines offside. Is it? I thought he was a defender. Obviously, I'm wrong. I'm guessing. Uh, I'm gonna have a quick moan at the team, so I demand more. Oh no, he is a forward. Kalen Hines. I I, I tell you one thing. This call's making me not have a clue what's going on. So yeah, Rooney's having a poor game, so I'll take him off Sam Winnell. Winnell's been doing all right recently, and Herbie Kane's been having a poor game as well, which is size lower after I've been bigging him up. But I'll give him a bit longer. Uh, free kick to Mansfield. Who's going to take it? I'm not sure. Pavan. Slowly takes it, runs up, takes it, just wide. Keeper seemed confident that wasn't going in, so I'm hoping he was confident. Uh, mate, sub. Uh, I'm reluctant to take Herbie Kane off. I know he's a good player, but well, sorry, not he hasn't been playing well, so I need to put some pressure on him. Uh, so yeah, Bryn Morris is going to come on for him, and am I going to make a double sub? I want to get Ro Ronan Darren's on. Uh, yeah, Reese. Mm, yeah, I'm going to put Mitchell off. If Ronan Aaron is a very good player as well. I've gone with this formation, I think it's the best formation to get the victory today, but obviously I might be wrong. Uh, get creative. Come on, guys. Can we get something from this game? Well, we're already getting something, but can we get more from this game? Demand more. Yeah, we're not converting enough of our chances. Yeah, and it looks like it's going to be a draw. Drawn too many games this season, I've noticed. And I feel like we should be scoring more goals as well. Because we get ourselves chances, but just not converting them. And what we're doing calmly. I'm not happy with what I've seen today. So, yeah. Well, hang on a minute. Pretty sure we just played a match. I'm sure it's going to update now. That's weird. So, yeah, we dropped down to 14th. Four points off 6th now. As we're trying to chase it. So yeah. Could do a lot of improving. So yeah. Uh, we'll go on to the next game now anyway. And I'll see you. Actually let's see what we've got in the po in the post. In the inbox. Uh, anything interesting. Yeah, hold on for a draw. Morris attack makes debut. Lynch. Stewart hey, scores again. Willis. Chantham. Blah blah blah. Okay guys. Yeah we'll see you for the next one. And welcome back. Uh, yeah, we've while we've been away, we've had the draw for the FA Cup come around, and we've been drawn against Forest Green Rovers. So, yeah, first round of the FA Cup, we'll be at home against Forest Green Rovers, which is pretty much this game. So yeah, we'll go straight into the game now. Um, match preview. Yep, yeah, played each other twice, and we have won one and lost one. So hopefully we can uh, tip it in our favour now. So yeah, the what formation shall we go with today? Do we keep an unchanged side or hmm, we'll put Collins back into the side because he's a bit better than Maguire. 
Maguire hasn't been doing it yet for me this season, but I do quite like him still. I don't know why. If you haven't been performing, I don't know why I like him, but but yeah. Uh, okay, so yeah, we'll you know we'll go with this, but I'm going to start Winnell and. Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to change from a new formation. This is, I want to discuss with you, you guys anyway. Uh, we'll change. Put Tuazi up front on an advance forward. And we'll swap these two around. Okay, so basically, guys, this is the new formation we're going to be trying to get working. Because I believe Mitchell is best suited for an a attacking midfield attack role. Uh, because all the highlighted keys I've got here is all stuff he's very good at. Like his off the ball movement is brilliant. His passing's really good. Okay, I need to work on his vision. Obviously, that is important. Uh, but he's also got his first touch, his finishing, his long shots, his dribbling. All that those aspects are what he's really good at. So I want to. I think that's the position I want to try and develop him in. Uh, I've got him a mentor as well. His mentor is Rooney. Uh, because obviously Rooney's mentals are just ridiculously good, his techniques and I do see him as quite similar players uh, and also try and help another player uh, Dale Collins also been mentored by Rooney as well, just mainly for the mental attributes, uh, hopefully he can try and pass on a couple of uh, the technicals as well but I'm not, I don't hold much hope there but it's mainly for the mentals for Dale Collins but to be fair that seems to be proven and uh, yeah, for some reason Mitchell what really isn't, but we'll have to wait and see how it how it progresses. We want to give him some game time there so he can try and understand the position a bit better. But yeah, this is the formation we're gonna go with today. Quick change. But yeah, we'll go for it and you know, see what happens. I've played it a few times and been getting some okay results with it, but yeah, we we'll, we'll see what happens today. Oh okay, I need to put an, somebody on the bench, set van the Berg and come out for Roberts. Yeah, and I think that'll be what I'll go with. Okay, yeah, here we go. So yeah, uh, it's Forest Green Rovers, the uh, the vegan club. Uh, I think we played them at the beginning of the first season, didn't we? Uh, all that time ago. Uh, okay, we'll go with a... Yeah, that <laughs> seems to work quite well. Collins is quite nervous. I need to try and sort that out. Passionately, uh, I have faith in you to go and make a difference. Is there a way I can? I just want to quickly look at Collins. He isn't. He doesn't get nervous, does he? For big games, hope not. No, that's all right. Uh, does he relish big games? No, well, not that I can see anyway. But okay, that, that's that's the main thing. That, you know, he can perform in them. Uh, so yeah, let's kick off. As the players come out for the uh, for the game, we'll get straight into it. Fourteenth in the league, really could do with a, a victory. And oh, I have a, a quick chance really, which is not a great start. We're off Forest Green. Uh, they're in a relegation battle this season, so yeah, really we need to be picking up points against them. Oh, good catch there by Smith. Got there just ahead of Roland. Roland Aaron's. I'll get there eventually. And Freya now on the ball. Acres of space there, ball whipped in, and Mondale with the goal. That was horrific defending. Not happy with that at all. Goalkeeper kicks out quick. We weren't in positions. Freya just picks it up, and you'll see in the bottom of the screen around there, there he is, ball whipped in. Just too slow to react. That's a poor goal to concede. Okay, I'm going to have to have a, give him a, a moan. Well, first 15 minutes, we've had a lot of the ball, but not creating anything. Mitchell, ball whipped in. Hoban, and Wallace scores. That was a great delivery and a great little routine. Ball in by Mitchell, as we'll uh, see in a second. And uh, I'll describe it a little bit slower pace. So Mitchell out there, whips the corner in towards the back post. Hoban wins it, and Wallace is there at the back post. Well, yeah, back post again, just to tap it in. A good reply. That's what we want. Can we take get into uh, half time with a lead? Because I could do with a victory. Mitchell, Matheson, 
loses out on the ball. Freya breaks free and Williams is there. Williams one on one strikes it. Good save. But he still gets there. Williams, but doesn't do enough with it. And as we uh, just carry on there. So yeah, we're not really creating as many chances. But we should be better defensively because we've got an extra player back. But here comes Hardy. What can he do on this left-hand side? Plays the ball over top, but not good enough really. If really you want him to be making a bit more of an insided run. Oh no, but Twazi wins the ball from a loose pass. Twazi one-on-one strikes. Oh, straight at the keeper and he tips it wide. Got to be doing better with those sort of chances really, haven't we? Mitchell now. Ball whipped in. Loco headed clear. Herbie Kane now on the edge of the area. Doesn't really do anything with it, but ooh, wins a free kick. I don't know how, but he has. So who's it to take? Mitchell to take this free kick. Ball whipped in, hits the wall, and it's out for a throw in. That's not good enough, really, is it? Hmm. Mitchell with the corner. Ball whipped in. Hoburn. Oh, just over the top of the bar. Getting closer. Starting to put a foot hold in it. And just watch him go and score now from this corner. Freer. Ball whipped in. Platt. Oh, what's happening? Is it going to be anything? And Oh, we keep it, picks it up. Mitchell corner. Ball whipped in. Hoban headed away. Roland Aarons get there, though. What will he do? He loses out, but wins it back. Leonard back to Matherton. Kane to Wallace. Hoban now. Plays it all the way back to the keeper. Ezgita. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. If, if I'm not, please let me know. I'll try and learn how to pronounce it. Kane, Mitchell. Mitchell now. Oh, terrible pass. Gives it away to Mondale. And uh, can we win this ball back? Not at the moment. Loco ball forward. Onan, but oh, Mitchell wins it back. Allerans now. Driving forward into the area. Tawazi. Tawazi shoots. Good save, Smith. That was a very long highlight. And we're about to see the corner, which we all know nothing will happen from. Mitchell, ball whipped in. And Hoban, oh, close on a thought. Kane, loses out on it. Onan now. Breaks free. And I'm guessing the end of the highlight will be here. No, it's still carrying on. Onan, ball went into Mandai. Mandal, sorry. Mandal, ball across, blocked. And Wallace hoofs it clear for a throw. But that wasn't the end of it. And yeah, it's half time. And it's not been the best so far. Far from pleased with what I've seen. Because I'm not happy. It's been a pretty poor performance. Collins down the line. Mitchell. What will he do? Back to Collins. That's better. Hardy now. On the left. Ball whipped in. Headed away. Freya. Gets that ball every single time. But Hardy won it. But gave it away again. Not protecting the ball well enough. Wallace wins the header. Herbie carrying back to Wallace. Collins now. Infield to Leonard. Leonard back to Wallace. All the way back to the keeper. Ezkita. As you can tell, but I'm pronouncing I really like that name, Ezkita. Kane. Oh, ball over top to Tuazi. Tuazi, one on one. Oh, misses again. Not great finishes. Uh, okay. Looking at the stats at the moment, looks like Hyde is not having the best game. 6.4. Matheston isn't having a great hard has gone down a little bit more as well uh, the reason Fitzpatrick isn't playing by the way I managed to change all my uh, corner routines to suit uh, Fitzpatrick with him being 6 foot 6 thought great, Oh, good save for the keeper goes and gets in took me about an hour uh, 8 hours, not 8 hours uh, about an hour, hour and a half to sort oh that's horrific <sighs> good thing I missed, I would have gone mental uh, yeah, took about an hour, hour and a half to do to build it all around him. Two days later, gets injured. He's out for six to eight months. So yeah, as you can imagine, I was thrilled when that happened. Uh, okay, our former player Dominic Bell's just come on. Uh, we'll put Zach Cliff in for uh, what's his name because he hasn't been playing well, and Matheson will probably come off as well soon because he's playing a six point four, which obviously is not good enough for what we're trying to do. Okay, next sub for Matheson. Put Donald Love on. Uh, and you know what? Tuaz is at risk of coming off as well soon because he's not had a good game. He's missed a, quite a few chances. Uh, Fry with the header, not back to Carson. Ball. What can he do with it? Into Mondal. 
Mondal now to uh, the middle, Loco. Ball forward, Mondal again now. But Collins wins the ball, boots it to Tuazi, but it's headed away by the defender. Kane over the top of the defenders now. Tuazi through one on one. Tuazi, oh, straight at the keeper again. It just doesn't seem to be happening for him. And I'm going to make the sub now. Tuazi's going to come off because he's uh, missed far too many chances. And I'm going to drop. Rooney in to be a deep line forward attack. Uh, actually, maybe a support. So, if these guys are going to be an attack, he's going to drop in and be a bit more creative for them. Uh, if we go, how are we playing the passing wise? Uh, edit. If I go, passing direct, slightly shorter. I'm going to go with that because at the moment I feel like we're going a bit too long. Hopefully, see what happens there. Get creative. I want us to be playing a bit more football at the moment. From what I've seen, it's a bit more lumped, and I don't want lumped football. Uh, Kutsumaka to Mondal. Loco now. Oh, Mitchell wins it. Mitchell, what can he do? Strike six, scores! Reese Mitchell, fifth goal of the season. Looks like he's won us the game, if we could see it out, that is. And that's a great goal. He's robbed the, uh, robbed the ball from Loco. One-on-one -on -one situation. Could have squared it to Rooney. Maybe to Roland Aaron. No, smashed it in with his left foot. And with 2-1 up, the young kid scores. This is what you want to see. Goals. That's all we want is goals, goals, goals. Loco now. Ball back to forward. Owen headed away. Leonard. Paul header. Williams now on the ball. To Mills. Williams on it again. Mills now on this left hand side. What can he do? It's blocked. Mitchell gets there first. Driving forward now is Reese Mitchell. What can he do? He's cutting in towards goal. He's on his own. He's going to have to go alone, but he wins a penalty. Oh, and it's been given. I'm just trying to see if I can change it, check the penalty taker, but it's not letting me for some reason. But I'm pretty sure it's Rooney to take it. Yeah, it looks like Wayne Rooney. He's trying to see if I could change it, but he can't for some reason. Wayne Rooney runs up, strikes it. Oh, his keeper saves it. Wayne Rooney's missed the penalty. Well, I'm not paying that much money to miss penalties. Rooney ball whipped in, headed away. And the defender there just dawdles on it. Who is it? Kane. Ball whipped forward. Dominic. Dominic? Donald Love, sorry. Ah, oh, Smith boots it downfield, and uh, fair of it. But Mitchell wins the ball again, pressing high up the pitch. Is doing really well in that role. Rooney plays in Clough. Clough strikes it, save yes, and cleared away. I was unsure at that angle if it was saved. Wayne Rooney's not in the best game, but he did slip through uh, Clough there. It's uh, Leonard to Mitchell. Leonard ball whipped in. Clough is going to get there first. What can he do? Played to the edge of the area to Kane. Herbie Kane strikes it. Oh, what a strike. And it's 3-1. 94th minute goal. Herbie Kane secures the victory. And Zach Clough with the assist as well. It's a great strike. So Clough picks up the ball from that long cross. Pulls it back to the edge of the area. Dale lets it run. Kane strikes it. Keeper gets a hand to it. But can only push it into the top corner. So technically, I think that was classed as top bins. I don't know. <laughs> Bit cheating, but you know, I'm gonna claim it. But yeah, a good 3 1 victory over Forest Green Rovers. I know they're down there, but to be fair, any victory is a good victory. Uh, dressing room. So yeah, nine from Herbie Kane. That, that's what I was saying before. He does just dominate the game for us in midfield. Uh, his ratings do come really good. Uh, I'm very happy the way you guys played. And yeah, I'm happy with Bruce Mitchell's performance in there as well. He, he won the ball lots of times high up the pitch and yeah when, when he's doing stuff like that you can't grumble at that can you oh, I'm really liking him as a player uh, yeah we'll give him some praise so yeah five games unbeaten now so we've got two wins and three draws so five games unbeaten I'll take it so yeah thanks again for watching guys and yeah we'll try and come back now uh, we won't come back for the FA Cup game because that's not much of a, a break really is it uh, we'll come back for 
the Tranmere and Ipswich games down here just before the transfer window. Then we'll go into the back end of the season and we'll see how we're getting on from there. So yeah, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Cheers. Bye.